Marquis, Vincent, and Rago. Please thank you. Our universe is immeasurable. Trillions of creatures crawl, swim, and fly through our planet. Billions of people live. Billions came before us. And billions will come after. We cannot count, cannot even imagine the number of perspectives and variety of experiences offered by existence. We sit all of this richness through the very narrowest of straws. One lifetime, one consciousness, one perspective, one set of experiences. Of all the universe has, has had, and will have to offer, we can know only the tiniest fraction. We are alone, small, our lives are over in a snap. But here's the thing, reading lets us experience life through a second consciousness. Let me ask you something, when was the last time you read a book? How many books have you read? this year. According to a recent survey that I have conducted in my school, more than 95% of students did not read daily for their personal education. If we do not think highly of reading books, then we are missing out on a lot of benefits that reading offers. Reading daily is one of the best habits that we can own right now. It develops your imagination and provides you with a fortune of knowledge. The more you read, the better equipped you are to tackle any challenge you face. Books will save you a lot of time and effort by learning from others' experiences. Elon Musk, the founder of SpaceX, has said that he learned how to build rockets by reading books. Bill Gates is another inspiring example Although he battled a tight schedule and a host of commitments, 
he manages to devote at least a book a week. So, if one of the busiest professions have time to read a book, I believe all of you can do it too. Good books can influence you, guide you in the right direction. But without reading, we are all limited to our lives. With it, we can know what it is to be the other person, to walk in their shoes, to see the world their way. My dear friends, if you want to adopt some good habits in life, then you can start by opening a book. Thank you very much. Please observe one minute of silence. Thank you.